Hi guys! Yes, we have the iPhone 10. Actually, I was abroad, so my husband made the real unboxing video. You will find it shortly on our channel. But this is my unboxing experience, even if I have already used the phone and I'm going to share my first expressions as well. But just for the sake of completeness, start with the packaging, which didn't really change. An awesome, white, fine, minimalist box with the first clear message, designed by Apple in California. The papers are the usual ones, not their content. Thanks to the new O-screen display, rounded corners, there is no more home button. Instead of that, it indicates how to start using your new iPhone 10 with simple and easy gestures. We also get the latest AirPods if the old one turned already in yellow, <laughs> which isn't really that funny. The lighting cable is the same. Here, I must say so, I expected more. If you are launching the best phone in the market that's already wirelessly charged and has wireless AirPods as well, why not basically sell them in one box with iPhone 10? It would be complete for me. I've been waiting, waiting for the wireless world for a long time and I really believe that we should basically get these instead of the old ones. I mentioned it's the best phone on the market. Well, yes, the other brands will need about one to two years to make it technologically compile. Just think about the E11 Bionic chip, or the endless list of lenses and sensors, and they all have been built into a relatively lightweight, waterproof and beautiful device. I think the whole scratch-resistant glass cover is much better than the old aluminum case. The phone doesn't slide in my hand, somehow much more natural and of course it makes the device really, really elegant and exclusive. The Face ID. You can unlock the phone with Face ID, but unlike fingerprints this only allows to save just one Face ID, but you can use the traditional Pascal unlock method too. If you start to use iPhone 10, the first look a little bit strange, because the time and other stuff so the status bar is not a separate line anymore, these are next to the sensors. The main gesture is swipe up at the bottom of the device and you will reach the control panel from the top right corner. In the settings you will find a lot more, actually very useful features, not just based on Face ID technology. So you can make 4K 60fps video or use one hand keyboard and so on. About these cool things, check our tips and tricks video. I'm sure one of the best and most interesting thing is outside the physical parameters and the new chip is the emoji. This is the new way of communication. If you can see facial gestures, you can pass much more information than simple words. Actually, you don't have to say a word. But it's funnier to hear the other thoughts and to see the feelings. But in the meantime, you will feel that your phone warms up. <gasps> I want to talk about two other things. First, the camera. The portrait mode is really amazing, but of course, sometimes it cuts you a strange way. But if you want to use this stage light mode option at portrait mode for anything else, it will not work. Because it works just with faces. Even if you could make some cool photos about your cactus or car or anything else, but you can't. That would be great to solve with machine learning and object recognition. Another thing, the full HD slow motion function, which is awesome, which checks these pom poms. The iPhone 8 and iPhone 10 camera delivers slow mo frame rate to 240 FPS in full HD resolution. So from now, we'll see very cool slow mo videos in YouTube and 9GAG. <laughs> Another part of the new iPhone 10 is the AR. Many believe this is the future, and I agree. Augmented reality offers new opportunities that we cannot even imagine today. Not just for games or home furnishings, but even technical assistance when installing something or life-saving help. So um, we will create a separate video for you with this topic because it deserves it. And yes, here is another example with the game, um, but you can 
check these on your own device. <laughs> So, okay, so thank you for watching. Uh, if you liked it, don't forget to subscribe and um, see you next time. Bye.